In this video, we present the iCandy system. The iCandy system adds a tangible user interface to the iTunes music and video application by creating paper tokens to represent albums, songs, playlists, and videos in the iTunes database. As an example, imagine an environment where the contents of an iTunes library is mirrored with paper tokens or cards, each with the album art prominently displayed so it's easy to recognize. In this environment, users can point either their iPod or some other pointing device at the album card to start playback. Here's how it works. Give it an album or playlist card. You can scan the card with an off-the-shelf webcam. The code gets converted into information that makes sense to iTunes, and the music starts playing in your iTunes application. Eye candy cards can also be shared or traded with friends. In this example, a friend borrows two cards. When the friend scans the first card on their own PC, the music starts playing. This is because the friend owns a copy of the same album. The album associated with the second card is not part of the friend's iTunes collection. When the second card is scanned, iCandy redirects the iTunes application to the iTunes online store where the scanned album is displayed. Here the user can listen to a preview and the album can be purchased. The album map is a clickable overview of all albums in the iTunes database. Because media collections can be quite large, we provide a focus plus context interface to help users navigate. The overview window is located in the lower right hand side of the screen. The map can be sorted in several different ways. Initially the map was sorted alphabetically based on the artist's name. Here we show resorting the collection by most popular artist. Users can also search the album map by either artist or album name. As the user types in characters, the overview area displays small signposts indicating the approximate location of the matching album. The playlist view is similar to the album view in that we use the album art associated with each track in a focus plus context interface. The left side of the playlist displays the larger artwork representing the tracks. The right side displays the overview window. The yellow area represents the current zoomed in view shown on the left. 